Hi everyone, AB again here with uh, my guest starring Audrey, yeah. and we're doing a video again for my YouTube channel called um, what's it called again? The Night of Modern Age. Oh, my Modern Age. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> and the reason why we're making another video right now is because uh, while we were doing the unboxing of uh, our savers, we were having diff excuse me technical difficulties. Thank you. Yeah. And so we weren't able to unbox and review all of them at once. But here's part two, and allow us to present both of the sabers that were pending. Here we have the Saberforge Standard Unleashed version with the Crystal Chamber, and Audrey's carrying the Legacy Unleashed version. Now let's, um, I'll put this one down for a minute. Uh, Audrey, go ahead and show yours, please. Um, the Legacy Unleashed was the substitute for the Legacy Monarch that Cibaforge had on, on their website for quite some time. And I know that there are some fans out there that either possess, respect, or that just prefer the Legacy Monarch, period. Uh, but if we take a moment to look at this, the Saber again, we see some differences that were made. Uh, we see that ribcage section that's protecting the Crystal Chamber, which makes it more suitable uh, for uh, light dueling. And um, some things that did uh, stay, uh, we rotated, we see that glass eye, of course, the Graflex uh, inspired S emitter, and we see in the back here, uh, the tactical switches. I know that on the weather edition, it had the regular solid metal piece here, but I believe either it had the flat gray, or it's, uh, I think the standard had the red button too. Um, but you want to, Talk about, take a moment to explain it, Audrey. What, which one do you like the most? This one. <laughs> Why? Because I like that it's weathered. It gives it a really cool style. Okay. Um, It doesn't look so put together, I guess. And um, also the grip is easier because of the finish. The finish is more of a polished? I guess so. Polished, yeah. glossy. So it kind of has that more of a nice... Not slippery to where it'll slip out of your hand, but like you'll get a good grip. Whereas this one is a bit on the dry, not drier end, but it has a more of a matte finish. So the grip isn't as easy. Yeah, and you know what? Um, if I take a moment to show you guys this one. This one, as I mentioned before at the beginning of the video, this one is the standard unleashed version. And if we actually stand both of them next to them together, they look almost identical the only difference really that they have is the legacy of course has the weather finish the reason why this one looks the same is because on the website it looks very simple it has different cosmetics for example we start here at the front this one just had a black flat top to it uh, something like this that just went on top of here uh, but I'll show you what this is for right now uh, the crystal chamber is the same over here in the back it didn't have the red button deal, so it had another flat gray surface button. And over here, uh, where this gold copper finish, uh, it was black instead. So it was very plain. It was still clean as well, but um, Saberforge was very kind uh, to make those changes for me. Uh, but let's go and uh, take a moment to introduce them. I'm a little surprised that Saberforge, um, actually one of the members of Saberforge reached out to me and inform me about one of these modifications for the crystal chamber. So let's take a moment to show them that. I knew that was gonna happen. It's all right, it's okay. <laughs> Technical difficulties. Technical difficulties. <laughs> Prop difficulties. <Okay. laughs> all right, okay. so as we see, we just twisted the knob. A blooper reel. <laughs> this is what we should edit out. <laughs> okay. Okay. So uh, what we did, we actually uh, loosened up this eyeglass part right here. And what it served is it gave us the opportunity to actually... Are you ready? Oh, you close it? I'll just see my mouth. <laughs> okay. Wait, you can tie it. <laughs> yeah, I can tie it. Like that. Um, yeah. <laughs> Um, the the gentleman has suggested that uh, he was able to insert this uh, crystal chamber protection. It, I didn't take anything off. All I did was just turn this, loosen up the eye, mm. and what it did it just made a 180 degree change. And there's the crystal reveal. So the reason for this, because I know um, I for myself 
I know that there are some others out there that enjoy saber fencing or you know just set lightsaber fight in general and sometimes there are accidents and uh, sometimes the lightsabers end up hitting the hilts of the other opponent and so uh, to protect the crystal chamber a lot better that's why they had this here I thought it was really nice I really enjoy this I don't think it would bother me if I were to grab it here um, but I'll make another video as far as testing this and how uh, how it feels when it's fighting um, but what do you what do you think Audrey should we light this up and show how it looks yes Awesome. Okay, I know you have to take the piss thing out. Yeah, the kill key. Oh, it's nothing too. These sabers came with kill keys. I love it. Yeah. So like, okay. I can't see. Here's your blade. Okay. And we have these little black tips right here. Sure. Thumb screws to tighten up the, the blade. Okay, this is the hard one. Yeah, I'm having a little bit of trouble. But, oh, I got it. All right, you ready? Yeah. Okay. Yes, yes, yes. Episode one. <laughs> All right, nice. And another nice feature. Oh, thank you, Audrey. <laughs> another nice feature that I got for these lightsabers was I got them in the hero tier. And what that does is not only does it have additional soft fonts, but it says color change. So. Audrey and I are going to cycle through the colors right now. Show them all of that it comes with quickly. Oops. Oops. <laughs> dark side. Dark side. So this is red. Yeah, you're sick. Mine's that purple. Mine's that early morning orange. Early morning and orange. Yellow. Sunset orange. Sunset orange, yeah. Very good. I gotta keep up with you. Green. Not like a green. I, I would call this like a kiwi. Not a kiwi green. A lime green? A lime green. Yeah, it's a, it's a nice color. It's a nice green. It's a nice green. Are we back at blue? No, I think so. Or oh, you're like at purple. Yeah. Like, yeah, this is not. Oops. Um, this is another thing that happened. Uh, I don't know how I did it. Um, let's go ahead and turn it off. Alright. Oh, just another thing. What am I forgetting? The crystal. That's right, Audrey. So I am so foolish. Thank you for reminding me. It's really cool. Yeah, when the lights are lights up. Oh, mine turned off. Oh. There we go. Uh, the LED lights up the crystal chamber as well. So it's a beautiful feature. This is one of the reasons why I got this lightsaber. Um, so, if you guys would like to... Take a chance to take a look um, at Saber Forge's uh, website. They have beautiful sabers. Every single one of them is so different. Some of them uh, are perhaps uh, second versions of particular ones, but they're really beautiful. Uh, I bought my sister's uh, from Saber Forge. That's the video that I uploaded earlier today. And she's, I gotta say, I was more excited to see hers because she designed that one herself. I did. She, and she even showed them the, the leather wrap again oh. that you inserted. She chose. Oh, yeah, focus. <laughs> leather wrap. Okay. So tell them, why did you choose that leather wrap, Audrey? I like leather, especially brown leather. Mm -hmm. it gives it that kind of rustic kind of feel. Mm -hmm. And yeah, it's nice when it's mixed with kind of, you know, the metal itself. Yeah, it really stands out. And it really actually helps with grip. It makes it soft and nice to hold. I know. It so. won't give you blisters on your hands. Nope. So, um... I love it. Okay, well, this has been our our review video for the Saber Forge Standard Unleash along with the Saber Forge Legacy Unleash. I want to thank you all for taking the moment to watch our video. Uh, but please uh, leave a comment, like, subscribe, uh, have other videos uploading. And I also want to thank Audrey for sitting down uh, in this video. It's really uh, late. Yeah, it's getting pretty late where we're at. <laughs> I think I need to go home. I actually had to come all the way to my sister's house to do this again. But I also want to thank you for, for her <laughs> yeah. time. She's been really helpful. It's not right. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, well, thanks you guys for watching. Um, again, like I said, I'll have other videos uh, uploaded. Maybe uh, some choreography videos of me playing with my sister or her fiancé. Oh, that's another thing, too. Um, I bought a lightsaber for her fiancé. 
Not from Saber Forge, just from another lightsaber company, but his is pretty cool too. I bought a lightsaber from my brother, so may, who knows? Maybe I'll do uh, sit down with them, have, do a review video with them. What do you think? Yeah. Right? I love that. <laughs> okay, so if that does happen, I'll keep you guys posted and let you know when it's going to come up. All right? Thanks, guys. Y'all have a good night. Good night. Bye.